Okay, hello Cloud Gurus and welcome to AWS This Week. We've got loads of incredible announcements this week. AWS Deep Lens is now in general availability. A new service called AWS Landing Zone has been launched. ECS adds daemon scheduling. API Gateway now supports private APIs. And we announce our Guru of the Week. I'm Ryan Kroenberg. And I'm Faye Ellis. And you're watching AWS This Week. AWS DeepLens is now in general availability, and DeepLens is a video camera that is also capable of running deep learning models. And for those who don't know, deep learning is a machine learning technique that uses neural networks to learn and make predictions. And DeepLens fully integrates with Amazon SageMaker, which is a platform that enables developers to quickly build and deploy machine learning models. So DeepLens can be used to build facial recognition entry systems and ob object recognition systems as well. So right now it's only shipping to the US, but we are expecting additional destinations to be added very soon. So a new service called AWS Landing Zone has just been launched and it allows you to quickly set up a multi-account AWS environment using AWS best practices. And by default, it will set up four separate AWS accounts. And these are a security account, a shared services account, a logging account, and an AWS organizations account. And you can even enable single sign-on across all four accounts to make logging on very, very simple. AWS Landing Zone is delivered by the AWS Solutions Architecture team, as well as the AWS Professional Services team. You can sign up to it by checking out the link below. ECS adds daemon scheduling, and Amazon ECS, or Elastic Container Service, is the service that allows you to run your Docker containers in the cloud. And it now has a new daemon scheduling strategy, which allows you to automatically run a daemon task on a set of instances in your ECS cluster. Now, a daemon task is often used in microservices to run supporting tasks like logging and monitoring for the tasks running your application code. And previously, this would have required some complex scripting to achieve, but this new capability makes scheduling scheduling daemon tasks a whole lot simpler. So you can now create private APIs in API Gateway, and private APIs can only be accessed from within your Amazon Virtual Private Cloud, or VPC, using VPC endpoints. Using private APIs, you can choose to restrict API traffic to stay within your Amazon VPC, which can be isolated from the public internet. Private APIs also enable you to securely expose REST APIs to resources only within your VPC, or to those connected to your data centers via AWS Direct Connect. So on to Guru of the Week, and earlier this week, we built an Alexa skill to select the winner of the 2018 reInvent ticket, and here's what happened. So it's been exactly one year since we've started filming AWS this week, and we've decided to celebrate by picking the winner of Guru of the Week. We're gonna pick the winner who uh, gets the free 2018 reInvent ticket. And we were gonna draw this out of a hat, but we decided to do it in a more cloudy way. So we went and built an Alexa skill using the serverless application repository. It's basically the Space Geek uh, skill that's been repurposed and now it's going to pick a completely random winner in the list of winners. So without further ado, Faye, do you want to do the honours? Yeah. Alexa, ask Guru winner who the winner is. And the winner is Leanne Robinson. Wow, congratulations Leanne Robinson. So we'll be in touch, hopefully you'll be able to uh, come to reInvent and uh, come see us. And yeah, congratulations. So keep being awesome Cloud Gurus and we'll see you later. So congratulations to Leanne, and we look forward to seeing you there. But for this week, the correct answer was C, and the winner and guru of the week goes to Eduardo Briguente Vieira, and I hope I said that correctly. And Eduardo is a software engineer working at Porto Seguro in Brazil. So congratulations, Eduardo. You're the very first person to be in the draw for our reInvent 2019 ticket. And you can also expect a CloudGuru t-shirt, sticker, and hand-signed uh, card in the post. Now, if you want to be in the draw for the 2019 ticket, the question is now live on our Facebook page. Link is below. So keep being awesome, CloudGurus, and we'll see you next week.